Welcome to Uplift Fitness, where we make fitness simple so you can live the fit and healthy life that you deserve. My name is Jake Marburger, NASM certified personal trainer, and today we're going to learn the reverse cable rear delt fly. So this is an awesome exercise to combat what we all deal with, which is going to be a forehead bad postural system. So we all have everything in front of us on, in our daily lives, and so we want to focus on things behind us so that we can, we can have a great posture. So the setup is very simple. Get both sides of the pulley system at a, at a level place, uh, typically about, about right at your chin or neck level. Uh, typically, I take the clips off. It's a little bit easier for me, uh, a little less noisy as well. So I'm going to have Chase grab the opposite side, uh, each one. Go ahead and grab that other side over there. And he's going to bring his hands out in front of him. Now, there's three parts of your, sh of, of your shoulder. You have your front your lateral and your rear delt, and we're focusing on the rear delt. So he's gonna bring his hands out in front of him, and controlled, he's going to pull his hands apart. I'm also pushing forward as well, so they're pulling back, right? Absolutely, so on most exercises, what we teach is shoulders back and down, but not with this exercise. When we pull our shoulders back and down, especially on an exercise like this, our traps, those big muscles in your neck, are gonna to want to take over that movement. So we actually wanna separate our shoulders, Nice, nice forward in front of us, perfect like that. And now front, rounding, correct. correct. So a lot of times we say shoulders forward, people go like this. You Absolutely this no. Up tall, shoulders separated. Yes, nice tall chest, shoulder separated. Now from this movement, you're going to pull your hands apart, and you'll notice very quick that you can't do a lot of weight on this exercise. You don't need to. The rear delt is a small muscle, and so you're going to be pull your hands apart. You don't want to overextend all the way back. There's no point in that. Just come out right, right to your sides. Uh, pulling controlled movement, not letting your traps take over. These look great. And again, it's the same thing that you don't let your confidence uh, overtake the movement, throwing out, throwing out a bunch of weight, trying to, you know, swing it around. That's just ridiculous. And we don't need to do that to get a great workout. So if you want to know how this exercise fits into your workout, click the button below or head to upliftfitnessohio.com and download your free workout plans made by personal trainers just like. Uh, so you can have a confident and effective workout.